How good do you think you are at spotting a liar? Well, when put to the test, the average person can only correctly tell whether a statement is true or false 54% of the time. That's only 4% better than a coin toss. So, is there some way of improving? Well, past research has strongly focused on figuring out the verbal cues and body language of liars. Maybe liars sound more nervous and avoid eye contact. In fact, the US government has spent $900 million training airport security officers to spot these behavioral cues in potential terrorists. Yet, all of this has been rather fruitless. On two separate occasions, the US Government Accountability Office has criticized the program for lacking any scientific foundation. This flaw is so obvious that even you can search in Google Scholars right now and find out for yourself how unreliable behavioral cues are. For example, one meta-analysis found that out of 88 cues, only 24 were correlated with telling a lie. There were a couple of relatively good cues, such as how cooperative and warm a person acted. Surprisingly, things like eye contact, fidgeting, and hand movement all had no correlation with telling a lie. In fact, on average, these 24 signs were deemed as barely perceivable by conventional standards. It's amazing that so much money was spent on a program with almost no evidence supporting it. Not surprisingly, the program to this date has failed to spot a single terrorist. However, nowadays, researchers are looking for better ways to spot liars. One of the most promising areas of research is cognitive loading. The idea is that lying requires more cognitive effort than telling the truth. You have to constantly monitor yourself and make sure your story doesn't contradict itself. Therefore, if you increase the cognitive load on a person by just the right amount, you'll get to a point where the liar can't handle the extra stress while the truth teller can. For example, one experiment tried to do this by getting the participants to tell their stories backwards. This led to a 20% improvement in lie detection accuracy. Another experiment did this by asking unexpected questions and got accuracy rates up to 80%. However, this area of research is still young. We should be careful not to herald these as the new psychological tricks until more research comes out. Otherwise, don't rely too heavily on body language the next time you're trying to spot a liar.